Hey guys, Derek here. Welcome back with another episode of Titans. This is season two, episode four. Uh, last time on Titans, um, it ended with um, Dick and Gar going to confront Dr. Light and kind of find him and then, or not Dick, um, Jason. Jason and Gar went to uh, confront Dr. Light and Jason kicked the crap out of him, but then it it ended with Deathstroke, just standing there, ready to destroy Jason, just take him, kidnap him, whatever he's gonna do. Um, <clears throat> so, it'll be interesting to see, like what what happens next. I mean, it, he already kind of stated that he was, like his plan was to. Um, pick off the weakest one and have the rest come to him like so he wouldn't have to do anything but take the weakest one um, and so it, I'm interested to see like what like what specifically their plan is to combat that um, and how soon things will come to a head um, I'm interested to see like what role Rose plays into um, winning this fight or, or confronting her dad. Um, interested to learn more about um, Jericho, that's who it is, that's his son, um, that died, apparently. Um, and so I wanna know like what the actual backstory was for that, like how, how did it happen, who's actually at fault. Um, still waiting on Superboy to come in um, that was, that was uh, teased in the initial trailers, and, and we're, we're still kind of waiting for that. I hope they don't take too long to introduce him, because I want him to play a, a decent part um, of, of the series. Um, we got to find out what happened to Aqualad, like, once they eventually introduce him, because I, I assume that's who died um, back in the day. Like, Slade just went and destroyed them. Um, and that's why they shuttered the place, and, and it had to be him that died. Because he's always been, like, a big part of of the Teen Titans in, in that respect. I hope Cyborg... I know he... The initial plan was to bring Cyborg over to Titans at some point. Um, permanently. Uh, but he, he did... He had such a big part of, on Doom Patrol that I, I'm not sure if they'll actually commit to bring him over to Titans. I hope he does, that would be cool. i like to see him here. Um, what else? I think that's enough recap of, of kind of like what we know so far. Um, and I'm excited to jump into this episode. So, here we go. Five years ago, okay. So it's actually gonna... What happened? He's jacked. Ooh, is that... That's Slade, five years ago. He's old man buff. Straight domed. Is he, was he a lawyer or a witness? He looked like a lawyer. Either way, he had a personalized license plate, so he deserved to get shot. Wait, oh my god. He's dead? <laughs> oh. Did you shoot them through the prison window? That's. That's good. How do you do that? He's killing everybody involved in the case. Oh wow, he was just, didn't even shoot him. I wish I knew sign language. That was not open before. It's a 
she know someone's gonna be? Don't ever let down our guard. Okay. Are they hiding? Ooh, Titans, that's what's up. How'd they get there so quick? Just him? <laughs> this is in the past, right? He still threw him against their minivan. Ooh, Aqua Lad. Ooh, they got a little something. Maybe that's why she's so pissed in the future. So he definitely dies. And they had a thing, which is why she's so mad. And why she doesn't want to think about it. Thought he was singing. I want to hear Dick sing. Oof. The arm just around her. She doesn't want to admit that she likes him. Man, you gotta feel bad for a guy. Getting shut down right before he's about to get murdered. How does she know? Next time, don't waste so much energy with Black. Atlanteans are highly skilled warriors and troublemakers. And clearly, Garth's been blessed with other noble attributes. <laughs> She's saying he's fine. Anything? He brought her a fish. What do I gotta do? Nothing. Look, it's like fighting a car engine. Keep pumping the gas and more it floods. Take your foot off the pedal and wait. I've been waiting for Don McCoy since I was 12. So what's a little longer? Well, he's gonna die, so he doesn't have forever. You liar. I need to go back to the mystery. What? Tonight. Bullshit. Jacob's activator is for a laser that was developed to take down nuclear missiles.
wonder if he'd get like radiation poisoning. There's just always a, a tank of water handy nearby. Dang, he's pretty strong. Oof, tag team. She didn't even hit him. <laughs> oh, she just power kicked that door open. Not even gonna shut it. You should. You should shut the door. Get some privacy. Is she gonna stay? Or is she gonna bail? That's her like one last hurrah before she leaves. No. I trust your good eyes are brief, but painful. Yes. Donna. This is why you slept with me? Because you knew you had it out? Can you please not do this right now? No. I'm like you, looking for that damn clownfish. I don't give up that easily. What does this have to do with clownfish? Nothing. Everything. I love you, Donna. I always have. And I always will. Okay, he walked away, so she's gonna chase him in. If he would have stood there and waited, she would have gone to the plane, but now she's chasing him. Knew it. <laughs> That's in the jet hole, lady. Come on. Oh. No. It's domed. Oh, Not domed, but he took it straight to the chest. Who's the target here? Donna? So he's not quite as uh, strong as Aquaman. Being able to. Aquaman could take a bullet. <sighs> They're gonna go after him. Ooh. Dang. Ooh, one week later. I'm dead. Uh, he's Jericho. Oh, frick. That's why Slade was watching him. Thanks. It's his son. Hey, did you see that sign of Aladdin saying? Come on, it's over by the wall. I'll show you. Check it out. Oh, he's not. 
Come on, Dick. He's not befriending him because he happens to have a <clears throat> common joy for records. He's he's trying to get to his dad. Oh, oh man, that sucks. <laughs> that was I I liked that episode though. <sighs> Well, I got my wish. <laughs> I wanted to know what uh, what happened with Aqualad. And yep, he died. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be more of like a, like they all together fight Slade thing and, and he gets killed, but no, he, uh, he was quick to jump in front of that bullet too, like, uh, obviously that was meant for Donna. Can she take a bullet? I don't know. That's interesting to think about. But, yeah, like this whole episode was set five years in the past. Um, opened up with a, a nice little montage of, of Slade completing a contract. Kind of shows how good he is. Um, and then... Yeah, just it's just the team. It like they it brought together all the current plot threads, like what, like why those things are important. Um, like it, it it brought uh, it told the story of them putting Doctor Light away, um, and like that was that was you know that wasn't hugely integral to the 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 plot because he's the he's the b villain to um deathstrokes like a not like deathstrokes number one um dr light's number two um and so the flashback didn't need to be this huge emotional important thing in terms of how they put him away so i i, I like that they they didn't put too much emphasis on it like they they put enough to make it important um and like so he had it wasn't just like one fight scene and then they put him away like he had a little bit of a story that he had to progress through before they took him down um and and it it used that aspect to play um Donna and Garth Garth the Donna and Garth's relationship um the kind of will they won't they type thing and right oh man right as she's like i thought i was definitely thinking like one when he went to the the hangar um and then she was like oh yeah like hugs him and like is like i'm choosing you now i definitely thought he was gonna make it past this episode and that they were gonna further develop those two's relationship before they killed him off but no, he just gets straight chest, like a, a bullet straight to the chest immediately. I thought I, I thought it was gonna, I thought it was gonna deflect off because if I remember in in the comics, uh, Aquaman has like he can, he's strong enough to like deflect bullets. I believe I, I, if I'm remembering correctly. And so I guess in my head, I, I kind of just assumed that Aqua Lad would be able to as well. But no, he just, he gets straight murdered right there. And then that lady, I'm guessing that that old lady, she was from Themyscira at one point. Um, and she's got similar Amazonian powers. Um, she's kind of like a go-between, um, between the, the island and in the mainland um and she just split that bullet like nobody's business and then Slade just ran after he he didn't he didn't kill him so he just ran I wonder if he'll still be in the past still plan on killing them or if he just chalked that up as a as a failed contract or maybe he was there to kill him maybe maybe that was his target was Garth 
Uh, I don't know. I, I, I don't know if we'll find out either. Um, and yeah, so then she, Donna stays because she wants revenge. And they find out that it's Slade. And his son is um, Jericho. He's uh, deaf, so he uses like sign language. I wish I knew sign language so then I could just like see what he's saying. Um, that would be really cool. I like th I, I like that though. They they cast a. I wonder if the actor himself is deaf, or if he just had to like learn sign language for the part. Because um, if if he's actually deaf, that's pretty cool. That's like um, the movie The Quiet Place. They they cast an actual deaf actress um, to play the daughter. So if they if they cast an actual deaf actor here, that would be pretty cool. Um, is he, at the beginning, I couldn't tell, like, they're in hiding. Is he hiding from his dad? Possibly. Or are they hiding from other people because people know that he's the son of Deathstroke? I don't know. Either way, Dick meets up with him at the end to use him in some way. It's a pretty scummy thing to do. I mean, granted, all four of those people are just royally pissed. Like, they're they're out for blood right now. So, right, right now, I don't think anything is above them. Like, they're 100% they're willing to use this kid to get to Slade. I think I think they'll ha they'll continue to have um there'll there'll definitely probably be scenes still in the past like as the season goes on um cuz they'll they'll develop they'll probably develop the the connection between all of them even more um cuz I don't I don't think the story is as straightforward as they just killed his son, and that's why he hates them. Um, I think he he's probably going to join the team if he has any abilities. I mean, he's probably got maybe the same abilities that Rose has of just, like, pure fighting. Like, he was probably trained um, by his dad. Or maybe he just becomes friends with them. Who knows? But I don't think the story in the in the present is as simple as the Titans killed him. Um, but I definitely do think they're going to use him to get dislayed. And that's pretty scummy of them to do, but in the moment, they're not really thinking of it that way. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens. This is... I like Titans a lot, and I... I, I really like this show, yeah. That was a good episode. But... That's all my thoughts on this week's episode, even though I'm like four weeks behind. <laughs> um, if you want to see more of the previous reactions to Titans, um, I have it in a playlist. If you want to see full length, head over to Patreon. Um, you can get a full length reaction to this episode, um, and it would mean a lot. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more. I've been Derek, signing off. Peace.